show me a sleepy. Say hi. Say hi. Hey guys. Hey guys. it's your girl honey here and i'm back with another bomb video so guys i really missed you i miss you i know you like honey the audacity but it's okay guys i missed you eh? yes yeah, so guys today i'm here to explain to you as to why i was not posting i know most of you have been wondering like where have you been what have you been doing what happened to you girl you're not posting so guys i'm here with the details with the explanations and first of all let me apologize for not posting i'm really sorry okay i hope i'm forgiven okay let's jump right to the video so guys i know uh it's been uh, long since i posted like uh like so many months like four four five months i've got reasons as to why i did not okay i was not consistent and some of them are personal and some of them i'm going to share with you so one reason as to why i was not posting guys is um my job i'm not complaining about my job but what i'm saying is that i'm so busy uh that i can't even have time for vlogging i work from monday to saturday so the only time i have for vlogging or making a video is on sunday and that same sunday i have house chores i have to go to church like i have a lot to do that i can't even make a video sometimes i don't even have the camera my husband has the camera so that's the first reason as to why I was not posting. Another reason is, <coughs> another reason is um, mental health. Guys, I was depressed uh, that I, like I was, I was not myself. From May, I've been depressed, and I thank God I'm good now. I had a lot of issues to work on my mental health and I thank God to people who stood up with me that um, I'm alright and I'm here and uh, for those who know me who have my contacts I know you know that I wasn't even posting a uh, status like I was just quiet not talking to anyone I, I was just feeling like being my I mean being on my own not talking not doing anything so guys Apart from that, what caused that is that I had a lot of responsibilities. I'm not complaining about that because I know God has been with me and uh, God has has always been providing for me. That's what I can say. So, a lot of responsibilities that I had uh, led to my mental health and my depression. Like I had uh, two siblings to take them to high school and uh, from May my job has been having issues. So you can imagine, you have two siblings enrolling in Form 1. And um, let me just say, like, you don't have cash. You can imagine. So I have to do everything on my own. I'm the one who is doing everything from shopping, school fees, and everything. So guys, it was really tough for me. Okay, thank God for the people who are there to support me. My boyfriend was there. My mom was there. Those who supported me in prayers, in advice, I really thank you all. So that's another thing that led to my mental health. Taking my siblings to high school. Because it's May and I'm thinking of how will they join, even though I have like two months, because they're joining in August. How am I even to? Uh, am I even going to raise the money? Like I was so confused. Like I was just depressed. Like I didn't even uh, want to talk to anyone. I was just confused. Let me just say that. Just 
I just stayed on my own. I didn't want any anything to do with anyone. I was giving up on myself. I was giving up on everything because I just felt like a like I'm a failure. I failed to to provide for my family. I've, I failed to provide for my siblings who are expecting me to provide for them. So that was one thing that made me feel very low not being able to provide for them and another thing is job that i've told you yeah job 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 i was so busy another thing is uh, the way i work from monday to saturday <coughs> always have issues for those who are so close to me know that something bad happened to me in january and my health has not been okay since then. So the way I overwork, it really affects my health. I work Monday to Saturday, so I only have Sunday to rest. The same Sunday I have chose, the same Sunday I have to go to church, the same Sunday I have to visit family and friends and stuff. So being the only rest day, I'm only so, 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 so tired so sick let me just say that because i i have to be on medication so that i can be okay so that i can start a week afresh you understand so it doesn't be so easy for me that's why i've not been posting so another thing guys is uh, <clears throat> about my skin i was really going through a lot like uh According to what happened to me in January, it really changed my body and everything. My hormones were imbalanced and uh, they, they were imbalanced and that affected a lot of things in my body. At first, I, I started gaining weight for like two months, which is uh, February and March, but I don't have pictures to show you guys, but I gained some weight. I normally weigh 55 kgs but that time I was about 60 62 so I had gained weight another thing is that I got an outbreak like you guys I think you can see like right now I'm, I'm improving my skin is improving I, I had a bad outbreak nearly corner spots and uh, pimples everywhere so I'm going to put a picture here so that you can see how I looked so I was working on my skin like I wasn't even confident being on camera or doing anything so I was just like I don't want to do anything I have to work on my skin I remember there's a day I, I, wa I was to go to town so ata kutembea kwa watu I'm not used to that skin like most of you know that I don't have spots nor even the acne so that was a big challenge for me I had to work on my skin I tried everything like everything when I say everything I mean everything I bought creams I didn't know I didn't bleach Jesus so I bought a lot of things I and i ended up using organic things that have helped me like I'm, right now i'm using black soap black soap sugar scrub and uh, a toner that i made myself uh, through youtube like i did a lot of research and um, at least what i'm having is really working for me so i only use the black soap and uh, i scrub my face with sugar scrub and then i i use a toner a vinegar toner that I made myself mixed by mixing with water so that's another video that I'll make you I'll make for you another day I hope it will help you and uh, so that you can gain your confidence again so <clears throat> guys that's what happened to me that's why I was not uh, posting I really ask for forgiveness and right now I'm back and I'm ready. <laughs> so, 
so that's the those are the reasons as to why i was not posting guys i was going through a lot i hope you've forgiven me and uh promise that from today i'll be posting hata kama nitakuwa si post like uh two times a week like i'll make sure like every week i have a video that i upload so that i can entertain you okay so thank you guys and another thing i like to tell you is uh i started a transitioning journey i'm transitioning my hair to natural hair so i'll be with you i'll be updating you i'll make a video after after six months right now i mean the second month and i can see the progress like this is the natural hair and this is the relaxed hair so right now i'm relaxing uh sorry so right now i'm transitioning my hair to natural because i don't want to cut my hair i don't want the big chop so i'm going to transition slowly by slowly and uh, i'll be updating you i know some of you might might be interested in transitioning your hair but don't know what to do and uh, what products to use and what styles to put in your head so i'll be updating you this is another video for another day about transitioning to natural hair so guys thank you so much for watching this video thank you so much for always being part of me i'm happy i like when you comment guys i know that i have people who are looking at me and i have people who are really interested in what i'm doing so guys make sure you comment make sure you like this video by liking this video you uh you support me a lot so share this video to your friends and uh, any your relatives anyone like to support me i know we are aiming higher like we have we have to go further like you get so i'm here to subscribe or like or comment See you in the next video. I love you guys. Bye-bye.